were first round winners at the 2018 Kappa Silver Boot. They're looking to keep their semi-finals tilt on track as they take on the FQPL's South United. And it will be South United through their new recruit, Kato Aochi, to get proceedings underway on this warm Sunday afternoon at Lions Stadium. Free kick for South to be taken by Anderson. And up high. Unmarked was Amerovic. Igic couldn't keep it within the confines of the field and out for a corner. Into their attacking half now are the Knights. Wide here for Walker. Slides one along the ground. Watson trying to negotiate around his man. And Helling had to make a good save to his right. Had to change direction there in the end. Saline, oh, he's been copped heavily there by Teddy Watson. Tried to, I think, apologise and Saline took some exception to it. Yeah, Watson just catching that left ankle of David Saline. Teddy Watson being talked to by referee Paul Eldridge. Says we won't have any more of that, thank you very much. And Saline looks... Severely inconvenienced here, and I don't think he'll be able to take any further part just at the moment, if at all, in the remainder of this game. Fortunate injury for South United. Meanwhile, Morgan Saunders. As the Gold Coast Knights build up. Again, Helling called into action at his near post. They've put themselves in danger. Have the Knights Aochi, he's nicked in. And sort of elected maybe to go himself first time. Instead plays in Arun Amerovic. And South United with the first goal of this match, 10 minutes before the halftime break. Unusual to see Mackay make a mistake in those circumstances. Put under plenty of pressure. And Amerovic with the goal. Reese Saunders. Through for his brother Morgan. Zeroes in on goal. Helling with the save. Walker tries to conjure up something. On for Watson. And the South defence escaped that one. Shadows of half time now. Played square by Smith. And South United have a second goal. Zemirovic again. Past the diving Egic. That's an important goal right before the half time break. So the boys from Runcorn with a two-goal advantage in second-half action, although Gold Coast Knights here early on as Morgan Saunders tries to blast through the pack. Schmidt, this time for Barwick, cleared away by the defender. Take a second look at that. Defender turned his back to the ball. It would have been tough to give a handball situation in that circumstance. Kai on for Schmidt. Once again... Referee Eldridge forced into a decision. Let's see if we can see this one. Did he get the ball there? Nick Piper, or did he make contact with the player? Gold Coast Knights players went up. Oh, Igic. Straight into his opponent, and he's copped it. Well, you don't want to cop it. Manabu Ishimoto. He's putting on a brave face, though. Japanese player can see the funny side of things. Yeah. Copped it exactly where you thought he did. Minute to play. Gold Coast Knights trying to battle here. Reese Saunders. He goes down. And once again, referee Eldridge keeps the whistle by his side. Squeezed in between the two defenders. I think that's a pretty good decision from referee Eldridge. Fair contest for the ball. Three minutes of stoppage time now gone. And the full-time whistle is blown. And South United able to avenge their first round loss at the 2018 Kappa Silver Boot in a 2-0 defeat of Gold Coast Knights.